so dark in here. I think I'm gonna turn the light on. Ow, my knee. <laughs> Ugh, that's better. I just always get that light up in the corner, you know. So, uh, I tried to not get it in the camera so it doesn't blind you. Because that's no fun for anyone. I got pineapple earrings. Upsall. I love Upsall. Haven't watched a new song by her in a while. Listened to, watched, whatever. Okay, so I did the wheel and I got Upsall. So I went to my request for Upsall and I have several. I looked up each song and wrote down the number of views each video has on YouTube and one of the songs blew the others out of the water and that was Drugs which had 8.2 million views on it. The rest were, you know, down in the 100,000 range. None of them were up in the millions. So we have somebody named F Franz? F-R-A-N-N-S, friends, requested probably a long time ago several Upsall songs and things. And they put Hindsight 2020, which I thought was a song, but when I was looking them all up, Hindsight 2020 is like an EP, an album, with only like five songs on it. One of which is Drugs. So eventually I want to react to all of those songs but I'm going to start off with drugs. I looked up info to make sure that you weren't supposed to watch them like in a certain order. You know, cause I hate that when you're supposed to listen to songs in a certain order, like to tell a story or something like that. And you get them out of order, but it didn't sound like they were. And this is what I read about it in an interview with Substream magazine. Upsell said that when she moved to Los Angeles, she would go to writing session sessions every day and write a lot of different songs based on how she was feeling that day. She would vent about it with her producers and co-writers becoming like therapy to her. So when she was signed to Arista Records, she had to pick five songs to put on the EP. And according to her, she had around 200 songs. Ooh, I want to listen to all those songs <laughs> that she wrote that year. So she picked the five that she thought best represented her life in the year before. She also wanted every song to represent an aspect of her life that had either stayed the same or changed once she moved to LA. For that reason, she says that Hindsight 2020 is an EP that feels very authentic to that specific year. I love that. Hindsight 2020 only had one single, Drugs, that was released on January 18th, 2019. Following the release of the single, she released a music video and some remixes for the song. It gained some attention on TikTok and is currently Upsall's most streamed song. I'm not on TikTok, so I miss a lot on the TikTok side of things. I don't know if I've heard this song before. I might have heard it. Maybe I'll be like, oh, this sounds familiar. But as far as I know, I haven't heard it. The songs on the album the hindsight 2020 album are called all my friends are rich stressed drugs smarty and fine sounds like a bad year to me <laughs> so this is drugs i don't know exactly what her you know if she what her battle with drugs is or if she does drugs or what her deal is with drugs but I don't know. I'm a really straight laced, like goody goody kind of girl. So I don't know much about drugs and I don't do drugs. And so 
yeah, I'm kind of like PC when it comes to drugs. <laughs> Say no to drugs, people. <laughs> Okay, so she's got, I'm not really sure what that is. Is that like a um, gigantic blunt? Is that what they're called? Is it a, is it a marijuana? <laughs> and then she's got Upsol on a flask. And there's some kind of green liquid in a drink and a cup. And a lighter, so. Oh, you say you're moving out of state soon as you graduate. Interesting. Yeah. Anyway, you're leaving. Need a hug. Okay, then call me up. No thanks, man. to the party for the drugs 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 i'm not trying to make a friend or fall in love 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 so just stop the faking not here for nameless faces pointless talk in conversations drugs 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 i just i don't exactly approve of the message ups all um I get what you're saying. You don't want to make friends. You don't have a relationship. You just want to do drugs at a party. You just want to be left alone to do drugs. Why don't you just get some drugs and go do it by yourself in your apartment or something then? <laughs> like, I don't know. I like the sound of the song. She sounds amazing. Her voice is amazing. Just kind of hard for me to get into it because it's like, drugs, I, yeah, I just want to do drugs. And I'm not really cool with that, but whatever. <laughs> Aim it for the drugs. Look who's here, pink t-shirt, oh you mad. Him last year, wish I was as cool as you. Oh, yeah. Check it out, you got that. to the party for the drugs 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 i'm not trying to make a friend or fall in love 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 so just stop the faking not here for nameless faces pointless talk in conversations drugs 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 i just came in for the drugs everybody's either here for the drugs or the sex Okay, uh, it sounds good, but it's not like a song I'm going to listen to because it's just, I don't think it's really promoting a very good message or anything. It's like, I get you don't want to be fake and, and pretend to have conversations with people and mingle and whatnot. That's fine. I like that aspect of it, but you just want to do drugs. That's not good. <laughs> it's not good to do drugs. <laughs> like, it's not healthy. It's a waste of money. It's, it's just, I, I don't really see much good in it. Like, I, I don't, I just don't 
really see any positiveness about it. <laughs> so, um, catchy song, good voice. I love Upsall. I just don't like the message of the song at all. It's not like, <clears throat> like a beautiful poetic song with like good social commentary, good like wisdom in it or anything. It's just, I just want to do drugs. So yeah, it's kind of sad that that's her. Maybe there's a hidden message I'm not getting. So let me know in the comment section. Maybe it's actually a good song in some way. Like it's a positive song in some way that I missed. But uh, I think it's kind of sad that that's the most viewed song. I have a feeling the songs that are not as popular are more of the Diamonds in the Rough that I'm going to like better than the poppy, catchy, I like drugs type of song. <laughs> well, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> That's my opinion ab about it. <laughs> Tell me what you thought in the comment section. Like, subscribe, and have a nice day. Bye.